Hey everyone, welcome back. Riley here from Leader Pro, the number one software marketplace connecting buyers with sellers of software solutions instantly. Today we will cover how to use Kixie for your marketing campaigns. Okay, so when it comes to cold calls, one platform that we like to use is called Kixie. Besides doing the normal calls, you can log calls, make notes on calls, and you can also have managers jumping in on the calls with the sales rep. But the way we currently use it is simply for cold calls. For Kixie to work, you need to install the extension, and once you have enabled this, a separate window will pop up, and that separate window will look something like this. So this is what the dial will look like. In Kixie, you can have different roles. So you can have the main person who is the manager and assign different phone numbers to different people. And obviously you can create different agents. So under here, for example, in our case, let's go manage and then agents. And in this admin account, you can create different agents and then they will log into their account and make calls and log calls. And I'm not gonna show you the numbers here, but essentially what the numbers section is, is you can get outbound call phone numbers. It used to be about a dollar now, but it's about five, so just be mindful of the cost. And so each agent should log into their account and whatever name you assign to them, that name will show up on the dial pad in the upper left or right hand corner. Now this dial pad is where the agent can make the calls and you'll notice that there are multiple functionalities at the bottom. So the first functionality looks like a contact and is pretty similar to your phone. It's just the contact phone book and it's pretty self-explanatory. The second one is pretty obvious. It is just call history and there's not much to show in call history. So in Kixie, it allows you to receive voicemails. So that is why this is there. And for voicemail, whichever account gets a voicemail, that account's email will get an email notification. And then just click on it and it will play the voicemail for you and you can go from there. And then obviously this is the dial pad. And in Kixie, if you want to send SMS, you need to assign a number to an individual person. There's also an option for you to do a group in Kixie. For example, you can have one person handle one account with multiple numbers and each number assigned to different clients or companies. You can do whatever you want. And then that person only needs to log into one account, but the disadvantage of a group is that it won't be able to do SMS. So the SMS will only work if you do one number for each client or if it's for yourself. So just keep that in mind. But yeah, these two are basically the SMS functionality and I'm not gonna show you here because we're currently using Kixie, but anyways, going back to Kixie, as an admin, you can have reports of different agents, call times, and see how many calls they made. And for each agent, you know, as long as they're connected to their CRM, then Kixie will allow the agent to do different actions during the call. And actions just means, for example, assigning a contact from different stages of the sales process to another stage, depending on the CRM you have connected to your system. And there are also SMS reports, and that is basically a stat overview. Another thing you can look at is call history or SMS history, and in the SMS history, you will be able to see or even reply to the incoming or, you know, if you want to send outbound. So there aren't really too many things to look out for when using Kixie because we only really use it for cold calls, but if you have multiple Kixie accounts and think that you might get phone calls from each account on any given day, then we advise you to have different Chrome users. That way, for each Chrome user, you can log into their individual account and from a single laptop or computer, you can just answer those phone calls. And that way it's just all done on one device, so it's a lot easier. And Kixie does have a phone app, but the phone app only allows you to log into one account. So if you wanna log into multiple accounts on the phone app, the best way to do it is get an app duplicator from the app store, and then you can have multiple accounts logged on. And other than that, there's honestly not much to go through here on Kixie, but another functionality Kixie has is local presence. So for example, if you're making a call from San Francisco to Los Angeles, the number that you bought on Kixie might have the San Francisco area code. So if the person receiving the call is in Los Angeles, they might look at the phone number and ignore it because they don't recognize it. So that local presence functionality allows your number to temporarily change to a local Los Angeles number. That way, the person who is receiving the call in LA will be able to see that the call is coming from their local local city, which can make them a lot more likely to answer the phone. And depending on the number that you have, local presence can help your number not be marked as spam, but you know, just test it out with the local presence functionality turned on and off just to see what works best for you, and then you can decide. And just one last thing, you can also have people from overseas log into Kixie and they can help you with your marketing campaign just by having a US phone number, so that's another great tip. So that is how to use Kixie for your marketing campaign. I hope that was helpful and make sure to subscribe for more tutorials. Join Leader Pro today.